An intimate venue, always a fine place to take in a match. The courage room. I'm Derek Ray, and sitting next to me with his tactics charm set the ready is Stuart Robson. And if this game lives up to its billing, we're in for a riveting occasion. It's Watford, and they take on Sheffield United. Thanks, Derek, as always. This should be a good game. Great atmosphere inside the stadium. We've got two teams full of quality, some interesting matchups, and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football. What more could you ask for? A chance to whip it in. And nothing tight about that decision. Offside all the way. Morgan Gibbs White. Basham. George Baldock. And it's with Gibbs White. Sharp. What can they do from here? Basham. Morgan Gibbs White. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Emmanuel Dennis. It has to be! And there it is! The breakthrough! That will do nicely! Yeah, here's the setup, Blake. Well, it's a great little back heel, isn't it? And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. And the ball moving again. Sort of response what we see from the now. Norwood. Berger with it. Possession one. Plenty of options. Ismail Assar. Femenia. Oh, moving it nicely. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. So, 2-0 now. Morgan Gibbs White, Oliver Norwood, in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Laid into the box, and a bit short with the clearance. And they can keep possession now. Well, those stats confirm what we've been seeing. Watford haven't controlled the play so far, but when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. Bergen. Oliver Norwood. Morgan Gibbs-White. And options in the centre. Well, still an issue here. Now can they counter clinically? Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Inching towards the interval, and it's going with home advantage. Stuart, as always, very keen to get your take. 
Yes, it's been a really energetic display from them so far. The passing's been sharp, the movement from the front players has been excellent, and the finishing has been clinical. They will certainly be happy going in at half-time. Useful-looking position, you've got to say. And a fantastic diving save. Trying to pick out a teammate, and the danger's still on. He continues his run. Oh, and that challenge carried with it quite the element of risk. Now, what's the referee going to do next? And this ordering off could mean the end of their push today. Well, there's no way back now. He's really let his teammates down here. Here it is now, a substitution. Into the box it goes. And it still could be dangerous. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half time here. Well, he hasn't quite had the impact and attack that we were expecting, Stuart. Well, Derek, he has to impose himself on this game. He's been far too quiet so far. If they are to get back into this, he needs to make something happen and start getting some shots away. teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences Tom Cleverley Saar in possession well, they no longer have the ball couldn't keep it Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Is this going to be a thrashing? 3-0 now. Morgan Gibbs White. Norwood. Connor Hurahan. Morgan Gibbs White. And a fine tackle. We only have 30 minutes to go. Now the pass in behind the defence. Quick thinking from the keeper. Norwood. And it's with Gibbs White. And space to cross it. Successfully cut out. Morgan Gibbs White. Donna Hurahan. 
George Baldock. Safe pair of hands did his job. Well, it was completely miscontrolled. Crisp tackling. Can you please remain where you are, and your coach will meet you outside of the stand. Thank you. Tom Cleverley. Lovely incisive pass. Well, as we see it again, he was never going to miss that, was he? That's a really simple finish in the end. A lopsided contest, 4-0. Connor Hurahan. So almost at full time, and the home side very much in command. Stuart, what have you made of their overall performance? Well, what an excellent performance this has been. They've had complete control for most of the game. Their movement, clever passing, and energy have been a joy to watch. It's been a really good win for them. Couldn't find a teammate. Throw in here. Camilo Hernandez. Lusa. Promising sequence. Can he do it? And still a chance. Not able to survive that attacking push. John Egan. Connor Hurahan. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. George Baldock. And there goes the final whistle. Not exactly what Blades fans had in mind. A defeat here. You're absolutely right, Derek. While the result is poor, the display was even worse. They never got to grips with the opposition. They were second best in every facet of the game. They need to do a lot of improving before the next time out. Well, as we run the rule over this man's work, positive after positive, Stuart. Well, that was a great performance. His understanding of how to find space was brilliant today. And, of course,